you a really big treat. We've got Garrett Grantham, if I can say this, Garrett Grantham from Goat Gap, Texas. This is a little town south of Abilene, he told me, and he's glad to be with us tonight. So right now, give him a great big Conroe, Texas welcome. Come on out. Maybe he went back to Goat Gap. <laughs> was there a lot of traffic coming down from Goat Gap with all the deer hunters on the road? There were a lot of them on the road from Houston yesterday. I don't know about y'all. I saw three trailers broke down on the side of the road where they didn't have enough grease for the wheel bearings, and everybody drove by and just blow down and look. It took two hours to get from the North Belt to Conroe. <laughs> well, I don't have anything else to say. <laughs> Brother Mike Davis, give him a big hand. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He had to find his hat. Oh, lost his hat. Yeah. Come on, little boy. Got to wait in the rain. Well, Garrett, where art thou? Yeah. Yeah. folks so glad to, so glad to be here I'm Garrett Grantham from Goat Gap Texas and uh, you know Goat Gap is over here about halfway between Hog Holler and East Mewishu and uh, anybody here from Goat Gap tonight no I never did find anybody else from Goat Gap but you know one morning I was reading the Goat Gap Gazette and uh, I saw a notice in there about the First Baptist Church in Conroe. Now, I heard tell of this First Baptist Church because I heard tell that they had a preacher that uh, named Rusty that used to wrestle alligators over in Louisiana. And I said, now that's the kind of church I'd like to belong to. So, I saw this notice and it said, they had a youth group for young people such as myself. Well, and it said, call Brother Mike for more details. Well, I did. I called Brother Mike, and we chewed the fat for a spell. And uh, he said, Garrett, come on down to Jumpstart tomorrow at McDonald's. And I said, well, fine, I'll do it. When is it? He said, at 6.30. I said, I'll see you tomorrow evening at 6.30. He said, Garrett, I mean, 6.30 in the morning. 6.30 in the morning? Oh, boy. Well, I knew I was in a heap of trouble because I am not a morning person by no means. <coughs> but I told Brother Mike I was a-going, and I was a-going. Anyway, the rest of the story I'd like to sing to you in the form of, the, of a song, and I call it the Jumpstart Blues. Now, <laughs> First, I need to make sure, is this microphone on for my guitar? I need to make sure my guitar is in tune. I have to. Yeah. <laughs> Sound pretty good to me. No time 
to even read the Goat Gab news. I had to get going because it was 6.32. I had to meet Brother Mike and the Jumpstart crew. I got the Jumpstart news. I got the Jumpstart news. Can't find my hat, I couldn't find my shoes. The sky was black, I had to jump start. <laughs> well, Ma and Pa drove me down to Mickey D's. The night wind so cold, I thought my spurs would freeze. Well, afraid that the breakfast was all that I'd feared. Cold McMuffins and a flat root beer. I had to jumpstart blues. I had to jumpstart the blues. What in the world had I got myself into? I had to jumpstart blues. Well, I heard a commotion. And I followed the sound. And I was welcomed in to the friendliest crowd. Well, we talked, and we prayed, we had a devotion or two, and all too soon, Jump Start was through. Now, just hold that thought for just a minute because I'm, I'm, I'm going to modulate. Thomas up at the First Baptist Church said that uh, every song needs to modulate at least one time. So, now this is it. Now this, this here is a handy dandy modulator that I got from Brother Thomas and uh, it works just great. Thank you, Brother Thomas. But, uh, <clears throat> I had the jump start. Jumpstart Why, oh, why did Jumpstart ever have to end? I miss my new friends. I had to Jumpstart Blues. Well, we walked to the People Mover and I was sad because I had had the bestest time I'd ever had. Then I heard a word that caused me great joy to hear. Every Tuesday morning we meet again, right, Chief? <laughs> well, every day I'm growing stronger. You know I could not have been stronger. And you know that I no longer have the jump start blues. 